With ATP 250 events and four challenges in the week behind us, the young guns had the opportunity to chase titles and decent points in the battle for the next-gen Masters in Milan. Well, no. 6 and the best U21 star Stefanos Tsitsipas was beaten in the first round in Esertagen Bosch, missing a chance to increase his tally of 32 wins so far in 2019 and extend the gap to the players behind him even more. The Greek is over 1,700 points ahead of Felix Auger Aliassim who had another great week, reaching the final in Stuttgart on grass debut, becoming the youngest player since Rafael Nadal with three ATP finals. The Canadian saved a match point against Dustin Brown in the semis before losing to Matteo Berrettini in the title match after wasting five set points in set number two, earning 150 points and cementing the advantage over Denis Shapovalov and Francis Tofer who are not at his level at the moment. Shapovalov is almost 450 points behind the younger compatriot, dropping eight of the last ten matches since Miami and hitting exit door in Stuttgart in round one. Tafer has scored just one win in Esertagenbosch and Queens, standing 25 points behind Shapovalov and 100 in front of Kasper Ruud who took a week off after reaching the semi-final at Prostoyov Challenger. The struggling Aussie Alex de Minor is still in contention for the spot in Milan, accumulating a significant lead over Corentin Moutet who has moved to the seventh spot after winning Lyon Challenger, his second of the season. At the moment, Corentin is the last player who would qualify for the next-gen Masters directly, passing Mir Kekmanovic who will have to work harder to catch the rivals ahead of him and book the place in Milan, so as Mikhail Umar and Ugo Humbert who complete the top 10 list. Let's block ads. Why?